Can you, yes you, be a math major if you don't like proofs? Well, I didn't exactly like proofs, and I did a math major, graduated, and went on to finish a master's degree in pure mathematics. And at that level, nearly every single one of my classes was proof-based. So do I still dislike proofs? Well, no, I grew to like them as I understood them. It's my opinion that if you like math, I mean really like math, if you love not just the computing and the number crunching, but also the problem solving and the concepts, you actually do like proofs. You just don't know it yet. You just don't know it because they're unfamiliar to you. Proofs feel entirely different from what you think of as math. In reality, what you think of as math is actually the application of proof, but I'm not here to shatter your worldview, I'm here to get you to like proofs. Now you haven't probably been around enough proofs to know whether you like them or not. But after some admittedly tedious practice, you'll learn all the notation and the general flow for solving proofs. And finishing a proof on something you've been struggling on for a while is so satisfying. If you thought it felt good solving a tough calculus question, you have no idea. After you're struggling with a problem for days or weeks, and finally you get some insight on how to solve the problem, it is just so fulfilling. It's absolute joy. Now if you do understand proofs and you can do them, but you still don't like them, can you be a math major? Well, yes, you basically just have to grind out those classes. You probably only need absolutely five or even four proof-based classes to graduate with a degree in pure mathematics. The rest of the classes you could probably pick and select them to be more of an applied mathematics, something that's less proof heavy. If you want to be a math major, my advice is to stick with at least one or maybe two proof classes to see if you actually understand them and end up liking them. In the big scheme of things, one or two classes isn't a huge investment and you can still take other classes to pursue other degrees. Now what I really think you should do is click this video right here. I picked it out just for you and I think you'll enjoy it. I'll see you in that one.